Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to give you an overview of a neat resource that students can use to explore how land is used around the world. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. It's the worldwide land covering map that's been produced by the European Space Agency. And we're going to go in and take a look at the map itself. So here's the, the home page where you can read all about it. But if you click on Explore, it'll take you right here to this view. And over here on the left-hand side, we'll see our key. And we can see tree covers, shrubland, grassland, cropland, built up, sparse vegetation, etc. And you can zoom in on it to get more detail. Now, this map is updating in almost real time, which is a really neat feature. And I'll zoom in a bit more on it. And as I zoom in more, now we're seeing more detail. We're starting to see more things that are built up. But we can go beyond just zooming in and using the zoom tools. We can go over here on our left hand side and we can look at layers we can export data but we can also look at statistics and if we look at the statistics we're going to load a search tool where we can select a country and in this example i'm going to select the united states so i'll scroll down and find that and then within the United States, I can select a state. And so I'll choose my state here of Maine. And that will show us that the state is almost 86% covered in trees. We have almost 6% permanent bodies of water. And the other uh, data here, we have a little bit of cropland, a little bit of grassland. And in terms of things that are built up, well, it registers as less than half a percent. And we'll have to zoom in to start to see those built up areas. Now I'm going to zoom back out. And let's look at another place in the world. Maybe I'll go to my neighbors in the north. And so I'll pick Canada. We can see Canada as a whole, and I'm going to select Quebec, and let's see there. Tree cover, 46%. Grassland, 23 almost 24%. Permanent water. And again, you can zoom in and start to look at the built-up areas, or what's categorized as a built-up area in the map as I zoom in. Now over here on the left hand side, if I want to share the current view, I can just click that share button and grab that. I can use the measuring tools here. If I want to measure across the map, I certainly can do that and see I'm going to measure this area. And you can see the dimensions of that triangle that I just made. And over here, we also have our map settings where we can turn on streets and borders if we'd like to. And we can see here, I'm using satellite view, but we can also use street map view. So that's an overview of the world cover viewer map from the European Space Agency. As always, for more things like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel. And a special shout out to Maps Mania for sharing this resource if you are really into maps, check out the Maps Mania blog.